Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here I do a lots of computer tutorials as well as unboxing if that is something you would like to see, go ahead and subscribe. Leave a thumb up on this video as well as share it to your friends, with all that said let's learn how to create text files. First you must plan, where are you going to create text files, is it in the system 32, in this case you are going to create text files on the desktop as a demonstration purpose only. In this case, you can use dir command to find out where is the desktop directory or else you can find the full path of computer desktop using file explorer, anyway, either ways will work. You see I forget to type cd, before desktop I got an error. Make sure you understand, what are you doing, don't try to remember. When you know the full path of a desktop directory, then you can use cd then type full path of desktop directory in this case, you see, I forgot to type in backslash, I got an error straight away, so there's some rules we need to know. You can start to create text file in that directory. It is very self-explanatory video, once you got the destination right. Then. Let's start it. To create a text file, so it is very easy, you just type file name extension txt. Well, let's do the difficult ways because my subscribers want to know, okay, we are going to create a batch file to delete files and then later another batch file to delete folders as well or both by using cmd command prompt. It sounds interesting. Hope you can sit back, relax and enjoy it. This is an educational purpose only, don't attempt to delete other people's files and folders. If you have a long file name and has space between it, it must be surrounded in quotes. It is simple like that, otherwise it won't work. If you want to see what you have typed in the file. In this case, it was a file name, delete. Sure, you enter type delete.bat in this case.
As you can see in this tutorial, a greater than sign is played a very important role by adding more texts into the next row. If you are being adding another greater than sign into it, then you can able to insert more text in the next row. It is simple like that. Thanks for watching. If you would like to see more, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Leave a thumb up on this video as well as share it to your friends.